What if the first computer virus from 1982 had spread beyond Apple computers and infected critical systems instead of just displaying a harmless poem? 15-year-old Rich Skrenta created Elk Cloner as a simple prank, but imagine if it had jumped to hospital networks. Life support machines would have crashed mid-operation, patients flatlined as ventilators shut down without warning. Air traffic control systems went dark across the country. Planes circled airports with no guidance, fuel running dangerously low. Nuclear power plants lost their safety monitoring. Operators worked blind, unable to see radiation levels or cooling system status. Banking networks wiped clean. Millions of customer accounts vanished overnight, entire life savings erased. Within weeks, every computer network collapsed. The digital revolution died before it began. Governments worldwide banned personal computers entirely, viewing them as weapons of mass destruction. Technology advancement was set back by decades. The internet never existed. One teenager's harmless joke could have triggered a technological dark age, all because basic cybersecurity didn't exist in 1982.